Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Recently Microsoft released a Windows 11 Insider Preview Build 2261.598 and Build 2622.598 to the beta channel. As a reminder, insiders who landed in the group with new features turned off by default. Build 22621 can check for updates and choose to install the update that will have features rolling out. Build 22622 Starting with the changes and improvements in this build. For the setting up, for the time being, you will no longer be able to uninstall apps with interdependencies, for example, Steam and gaming apps running on Steam, or repair Win32 apps under settings. Installed apps. However, you will still be able to modify and uninstall Win32 apps without interdependencies. This was the only change in this build. Coming to the fixes in build 22622. For File Explorer, fixed an issue leading to a small set of insiders with launch folder windows in a separate process not being able to launch File Explorer in the last two flights due to an Explorer.exe crash. Next to that, fixed an issue where you couldn't interact with the top part of File Explorer, with the address bar, when File Explorer was full screen. Also fixed an issue where command bar items like copy, paste, and empty recycle bin may unexpectedly not be enabled when they should be. Fixes common for both Build 22621 and Build 22622. Microsoft fixed an issue that creates a duplicate print queue. Because of this, the original print queue stops working. Also, fixed an issue that affects roaming user profiles. After you sign in or sign out, some of your settings are not restored. Coming to the known issue, clicking the network icon on the lock screen does not work, and will crash the lock screen, and may require you to reboot to log in. After logging in, you can switch between wireless networks as needed. So, that was all from Microsoft for this build. If you want to know more, follow the link to the official Microsoft blog, from the description. Hope it was useful. Consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any questions, just comment down below. Thanks for watching, and have a great day ahead.